Hi. Water. H2O. Two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen. You can get water from a faucet. You can get it in puddles, rain, snow, sleet, hail, ice. You can find it in streams and creeks and rivers and ponds, lakes, seas, oceans. Water is everywhere. And we all need it, but it can sometimes be dangerous too, in small bits like in a puddle or in large amounts like a flood or tsunami. And that's why my parents wanted me to make sure I knew how to swim at an early age. And like I said, we also need water. We have to drink it every day and often. So my family became members of a local swim club in our neighborhood. And for many, many years, that swim club was the center of a lot of great friendships and a lot of sports activities. And a lot of those sports activities were around water. Lots of it. We had a good-sized regular swim pool, uh, swimming pool, and we had a separate diving pool as well that had two different boards, one meter and a three meter board. Uh, we had a basketball court, we had volleyball court, we had a snack bar. It was the center hub where everybody from the neighborhood and as well as surrounding neighborhoods uh, passed our summers. I was really glad I had learned how to swim. We had a swim team and we had swim meets. We played Marco Polo. We laid out in the sun. There were organized pool parties. Uh, we had bands come to some of those parties at night. We had contests. We had prizes. It was a lot of fun. Several of us became close friends, lifelong friends. Um, and we did other activities outside of that local swim club. One of my favorites was going whitewater rafting at Ohio Pow on the Yakagani. Um, that was a lot of fun, but it could also be a little dangerous. You get some fast moving water, you get rocks and boulders in the water, people would get thrown out on occasion. Um, you could get pinned up against the rocks, but it was fun and if you knew how to swim, there were people there to guide you and they kept you safe. But you wanna know how to swim. I was glad I had learned how to swim. A few years later, I became a lifeguard and I, at first I was a lifeguard at small country club um, and a couple of years later I was a lifeguard at the wave pool out at Boyce Park and there's a lot of difference between being a lifeguard at a calm flat water pool and at the wave pool and if you've never been to the wave pool that's a lot of fun I was really glad I had learned to become a lifeguard uh, it taught me a lot of life skills it taught me how to look out for other people it taught me how to do maintenance around a pool and to take care of things. Um, I, I enjoyed those lifelong skills and I still use a lot of those. So I was really glad I had learned how to swim and really glad that I had learned the skills to become a lifeguard. So remember, we need water, we need to drink it. You'll hear people say hydrate, hydrate often. So water, two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen, H2O. Hydrate humans often. Hope you guys have a great camp. Take care. Bye.